Hey tubes. This is going to be my annual spring uh, getting them going. This is my inventory that I've I, um, gathered up for, uh, from the off season. All of these were free except two of them I got from bartering. Um, uh, and uh, I, I tuned up something and the guy gave me two free mowers for it. Um, I'm just going to go through them all. Uh, try to start them. There may be a few of them that need some uh, like minor work, and I'll go through and what they are. Um, this is a, a snapper with electric start. I need to touch up the paint on it. The electric start does work, but the battery's dead, and I don't have a charger for it. But I put my um, jump pack on it, and it's, it tried to start. Um, this is a Toro deck. But the Kohler engine was whacked, so I got this engine off of a um, Troy belt, which had a missing cover. That I, but I had a this cover for it. I'm just gonna. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just take this sticker off, so no one will know. Um, or I'll just take half the sticker off or something, because um, it's the same engine. Uh, and the bag was uh, isn't exactly the right one, but it sort of fits. Um, this this is a Husqvarna with a Honda engine. Uh, everything on this works. It's got a new blade on it. Um, this is uh, your bottom of the line Murray Briggs Classic. Um, does it runs? I just I just uh, you know kind of tuned this up recently, um, and I did have to make a fix the cable uh, by putting uh, just a wire in to run a cable. This one here, uh, this one here was trash picked. This Bowens, I had a bag that fit it. Um, I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna try to help out the, that wheel there that's, that's bending in. Maybe touch up paint it a little bit on the deck. I, I don't have this Hunter Green um, paint. Maybe I'll just, you know, touch it up black. And then I'm gonna put a new pull cord in it. But this runs. Um, Levi, it's a new, it's a new filter, new primer bulb, a uh, different gas tank, and a new diaphragm kit. Uh, and the blade is used, but it, it's sharpened. This one over here, this uh, Troy built, Tough cut, I believe it's a tough cut. True, uh, um, this one works. It, it's when it runs, it sounds a little wonky, so to speak. Uh, it does run though. Self-propelled does work, but the cable is toast. Self-propelled cable is toast. Um, I'll have to get a new uh, get a new one. And the bag is it didn't come with a bag, but I had one that was brand new. Um, that one was free as well. This Honda here, uh, an acquaintance of mine gave me. He says it didn't run right, and I went through it and um, found out that the carburetor was messed up. So I had a carburetor that happened to fit it, and I that was clean. I just put it in it, and it worked. So it's got a new air filter, sharpened blade with a quarter cut system, and a fresh oil change. This one here, this is a Lawn Boy. Uh, this is the oldest one of, the well, oldest lawnmower I have in my cord. Um, I mean, as far as long as I've had it. Um, Cause I, um, there was a, I, I, there was some stuff I had, I just didn't get to, um, didn't have time to. Well, it has a, uh, this is a full tune up, rebuilt carburetor, new air filter, different gas tank cause the original one was cracked. I had that. Uh, redid the pull cord. I redid the um, the pull cord. Not, I mean, just redid it. It didn't put a new cord in it. Uh, and um, it's got a uh, what was it? Oh, and I sharpened the blade. And I had to fix an oil leak uh, where the two where the the on the oil sump where the two um, halves meet. Um, there was a leak in that seal. Uh, I fixed that with some RTV and then pushed it back together, and it's. It hasn't leaked since. Um, and I think that's it. Let me...
I'll make uh, bring you in on some of these tidy up type things. Um, but that's it. Okay. This is a Husqvarna a rear wheel drive with bag. I got for um, with a Honda engine. I got as part of a um, bartering deal when I tuned up a mower. Uh, I just uh, so uh, I'm gonna give it a start. This is a, uh, I think a 96 Murray, bottom of the line. Uh, I picked up for free. I put a new primer bulb in it. Uh, made a, a cable for the brake and put a couple used wheels on and sharpened the blade and changed the oil. It's a Toro deck. It had a Kohler engine on it that was Dunsky. And I had this um, Briggs & Stratton quantum engine that came off of a Troy built that I put on here. But the Troy built didn't have the engine cover. So I had this plastic engine cover, which I'm gonna push mower. So I blanked out the, uh, where it says push mower. Uh, so I just wanna put some, uh, and it's got a new 22 inch blade. Got some fresh gas in it. Let's uh, hope it goes. Okay. This next that one good. is a uh, Lomboy Silver Series with a Tecumseh engine, five and a half horsepower. I put a new uh, brake cable on it. It's actually for a different mower, but it seemed to fit. A new traction cable, uh, another gas tank. Redid the, uh, rewound the um, pull cord and rebuilt the carburetor. A new air filter, and there was an oil leak that I fixed with some RTV. So let me get some gas in this. Primer start. I haven't started this one in a couple months, so I hope it runs. This is the one that I, uh, I, I uh, combined different carburetors to get one that was a fixed throttle because the throttle uh, thing on this one was messed up. So I made it a fixed throttle. This one here is snap run. It's going to show it running. I need to touch up the paint on it. Uh, other than that, it's uh, and the starter does work, but the battery is dead and there's no. I don't have a char the charger for it. I know the starter's good because I used my jump pack on it to start it. Um, actually, if I see if I can find my jump pack, I'll start it that way. <laughs> Get some gas in it. See, I've got my my jump pack on on the starter. I mean the battery. So testing the starter out. Wait. Hang on. The battery says so it says like 11 point something volts. Let's see. <laughs> So, starter works, but uh, batteries that one. I said I was going to paint. Ended up painting the whole, trying to re repaint the whole thing. Took the engine off the deck. Put a new pull cord in it. It's not great. It's not perfect, but it's you know that you can see where the rust spots are, and then I painted over them. But it'll it'll do. Um, this one's got a new pull cord, new primer bulb, new gas tank, or uh, uh, another air filter. Uh, a different spark plug, um, sharpened blade, sharpened used blade, um, 
There must be there was something else. E, I don't remember. It was so long ago. But uh, oh, yeah, and I am um, uh, straightened out the wheels. They were a little bit uh, angled. So here we go. See, it's most a little bit. That's probably because I had it sitting outside for a bit. Here's the Honda uh, HRB 215. It's like 20 years old. When I replaced the carburetor. the rear wheel drive does work. Uh, I do have um, this one over here, it'll, it'll run. I just gotta uh, replace the uh, the uh, self propelled belt cable. Let me show you how oh, this one, the arachnophobia mower. Every time I go to it, there's spider ribs all over the handles. I think there's a spider in there. But hopefully he's dead now. Anyway, uh, I got to replace the brake cable, but uh, uh, it does run. A little rebuilt carburetor, blade sharpened, oil changed, uh, new spark plug, and I washed it. Ready. Better than it did last year right after I fixed it. And I think that concludes everything. I've just got to do some paint work on the, or maybe get that starter battery working on the uh, snapper. And uh, a couple of them I need to do a test mo and I got to fix this cable. Yeah. Thank you. Show you what I do. To uh, prep these for sale is after I've washed them all and every work on them, make sure they work, paint a few things. I go through and I uh, wipe them down with a little WD-40. That kind of brightens up the paint. So this one on the reds it works pretty good. Put a little WD-40 on it or penetrating over whatever you have. Get my wipe down. Looks a lot better. It doesn't it, don't, it doesn't last long, but it'll do good for a, a picture. Here's the end result of just a WD-40 wipe down of the of the deck. Brightens it up a whole lot. It doesn't last that long, but uh, it makes it look a lot better. As you saw, I got all these to run. I've uh, tried to paint paint some and whatever, and get them ready. I got one that I need to, uh, that I need to get a part for. Uh, and that they're all ready to go. Some of them I may. I like to try them out before I um, before I sell them. I'd like mow my own lawn or something. Uh, so a couple of these I'll need to use first before I sell. Later tubes.